welcome in LaTeX tutorial and uh, in this video we will only look uh, about the main features of TechMaker when you will open your TechMaker first time then interface of the TechMaker you will uh, see like this uh, interface so this is the structure interface and uh, this is the source code interface so let us first start uh, with the top panel in a file there are several options new we can create our new file by pressing here or just press ctrl plus n or just press here we can also create new file by copying an existing file I have one existing file here so I want to copy this file in my new uh, file so I'll just select this just delete here we can open our existing file by pressing ctrl plus o uh, we can uh, clean our recent file by pressing here we can restore our uh, uh, previous session save our session and we can load our session we can save our file by pressing here or just press ctrl plus s or uh, we can go directly at, at this icon we, we can uh, save our file in a different uh, extension so if you uh, click at save as then uh, we'll have a uh, lots of options so we will save our uh, file in a different extension as per our requirement and we can go for exit by pressing ctrl plus q now come in edit option first option is undo then redo now copy ctrl plus c we can cut by pressing ctrl plus x paste ctrl plus p select all Ctrl plus F. We can put our text in a comment. Just select all and press Ctrl plus T or go to edit and uh, press here. Similarly, we can do uncomment all by going to uncomment. We can make a space in the first line of paragraph by using indent. I want to make some uh, space in the first line, so I'll select all and just will go to indent. Similarly, we can put uh, it in unindent. So just select and go to edit and press here then find ctrl plus f find next find in directory replace we can replace some text by uh, using ctrl plus r in a wizard we can quickly start our document by using quick start option i choose article uh, i can change my typing size and i can write here title and then check your geometry package ms package index package graphics package Similarly, we can quickly start our Beamer presentation. So if I click here and then I, I can change my theme. So I choose Madrid, typing site, uh, I choose 14 point, recording, author, I can write my author name, title name, and then language, MS package, graphics package, yeah, it's okay, and then press here. Okay. Similarly, we can uh, quickly start later. Uh, we can create table. So this is 2 plus 2 and we can increase row column similarly yeah and we can uh, and then I want to merge so uh, 3 4 5 so just to here 3 and 5 so I can merge here you can uh, change your, your border left and right both by uh, selecting this option we can put uh, our uh, text in a center left right or we can change our width of the column and then press ok we can create tab similarly I can write matrix and other types of array so I want to write 3 cross 3 matrix so just I will select here 3 3 and center yeah array types of array the BM matrix and yeah then I can write here my text in a tools menu we can compile our file by pressing F1 if I press here, I can view my PDF file and uh, same thing I can do by pressing this arrow. I can uh, compile my tech file by pressing F2. I can view my DVI file by pressing F3. So if I press here, I can view my DVI file. We can change our DVI into PS format. We can uh, uh, compile PDF LaTeX by pressing F6. So PDF LaTeX and LaTeX are almost same, but uh, but when we use graphics in our document, then PDF LaTeX is much uh, useful than uh, LaTeX. We can view our PDF file by pressing here, and also same thing we can do by pressing this arrow. We can convert our PS file into a PDF format, DVI file into PDF format by pressing F9. We can uh, view our log file. We compile our BIP file by pressing F11 or same thing we can do here BIP file we can compile here if we, we use uh, BIP tech file and if we, we use uh, nomenclature glossary package then we can uh, update this file by pressing F12 
or same thing we can do by pressing here make index sim2 compilation is used when we use a, a sim2 package this package is used for uh, vector graphics latex mk latex mk actually is used also for compilation and uh, when we need to compile our file more than one time then latex mk is useful then edf latex and uh, latex clean we can uh, delete our uh, log files by pressing here and then we can delete all log files we can export our file in a different format and most of the tools option we can see inside this navigation we we'll build latex dvi to ps pdf latex web data mac index and post dvi ps to pdf dvi to pdf sm2 uh, latex mk rc and in latex we can uh, directly use the document class without typing so just click here and then here i my document class then package i will have to write here package ms package begin document end document author then sectioning part chapter section sub section sub sub section paragraph sub paragraph chapter then font style is slanted and then include graphics we can add our graphics without typing so just select our picture and then include we can include any files in the same directory and input we can add a file from the other directory and uh, we can use label side footnote bibliography style bibliography command without typing now come to the math and in a math menu we can use these uh, option without typing so i use here dollar sign and i write display math mode in a bibliography there are three options biblioteca biblioteca and clean so biblioteca actually has a more options than the biblioteca so let us check by one example i choose uh, article and uh, one example for bibliotech so here you can see that in a bibtech there are uh, less options than the bibliotech we can remove these optional things by using uh, uh, clean options so just go to bibliography and select it clean so you can see that all optional things uh, have gone and only required things are coming author title journal year author title journal title and year yeah. in user there are three options with the help of user tags we can create our own shortcut so suppose i want to create my own shortcut i will go to edit user tag and then i want to make one shortcut for begin document and uh, end document so i'll write here i will give some name and in a latex content i will write uh, percentage document percentage gives a environment in the latex content now if i press shift plus f1 i will get my document environment uh, we can directly uh, press here or just use shift plus f1 in the keyboard similarly uh, you can create a total 10 uh, shortcut for a menu to I want to print uh, vector and ok so if I press uh, shift plus f2 or just press here directly otherwise you can uh, press uh, in the your keyboard then vector is coming with the help of user commands we can create our own compilation commands so you have to just go to edit user commands and I want to create one command for uh, latex and bibliography so here I'll write bib all and here I'll go to wizard so for a bibliography we'll generally compile at uh, four times so first uh, pdf latex add then we go to bib tag add and then go to again pdf latex and add it two times and then go to ok now our new command will be in this navigation bar we can see here yeah so when we use this command then we will not have to go uh, compile four times 
uh, we will only compile uh, one time and uh, customize completion let's understand the, this option by one example if i write byte slash view then you can see that technmaker is suggesting me for some options so i can uh, select uh, one of the suggested option or i can write a, a, a command myself so oh, I, here i want to add some more options so that so whenever i type a backslash view i want technmaker to show all of the uh, options which i have added in this list so for the adding the, my options in the list i will have to go to uh, user and then customize completion and here i will add my commands Now again if I write backslash div so you can see that all options are coming now in a view menu we can uh, go to next document tbs document uh, we can uh, remove a structure interface we can again uh, add a stru structure interface same thing we can do from here we can toggle on and off we can uh, remove message log file we can add message log file at the bottom or the same thing we can do from the bottom and then source viewer we can add or remove we can see the open file here at the bottom i have opened two files features and untitled we can see here also we can remove edit toolbar also we can remove tools we can remove file tools bar now come to the help menu in the help menu uh, we can see latex reference so if we click here then we can get any information about any command just click there and get information or uh, you can type here in a user manual you can get all informations about uh, the tech maker setting and others in a tech doc selection we can get uh, information about uh, the class of the documents used so if i write here later then latex wiki book i can get any information from the internet then check for update you can check here latest version so just click here or go to download page yeah so you can download techmaker from this website and then you can get the information about techmaker now come to the options menu then just go to configure techmaker and first i will uh, check this option so you can see that one more interface is coming now uh, if i compile my file so you can see that my uh, pdf file is coming in the same interface i can remove my structure uh, interface so i can view my code and uh, pdf file simultaneously and again i will go to configure technical uh, if i use external viewer then i will have to set path of my installed uh, probate reader now again if i compile this so now this time i can view my file in my acrobyte uh, reader but i always prefer to use uh, embed option so built in viewer and no need to change other options uh, now go to quick build here we can change our quick build command by default it is pdf latex plus uh, view pdf uh, but uh, we can select any of the mentioned uh, option and in the editor we can change the font style uh, and also font size typing remember that this is the uh, typing font size it will not affect your uh, pdf file we can also make backup of our document so just check here and uh, yeah okay here uh, we can change our shortcut but i will not change here and then go press it okay if we see left vertical panel in a structure and if i press here then we can see that uh, there are lots of uh, symbols so we can use uh, directly if i click here then it will come in our source uh, interface uh, automatically similarly if i go to arrow symbol here all types of greek symbols are coming and then some more symbols some more options are coming we can use as per our requirement if you see this vertical uh, panel then if i click here label reference page reference index site footnote we can use uh, directly from here subscript superscript fraction defraction square root so that's all thank you for watching